بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما Okay, so uh, coming to the uh, your profile, like if you just quickly analyze your current profile. So basically, you are more into network uh, security kind of consultant kind of role based on your previous experience. That's something uh, you have. Your profile is more into more than I think ten plus years of experience. That's something you have. So recently, as as per your discussion, you had moved to UK. That's something, and where you are looking for a kind of a job role. Uh, job role. So, and also you have been working on the ACI course with us, uh, planning to get into more into the D DC uh, data center, and also you have an experience on this data center as well. So, so basically you want to completely move on to the data center pro kind of profile. But again, when you when you talk about consultant uh, roles, when you are going for any kind of consultant roles or design roles, uh, or any kind of high end manager roles. So basically, they expect you to have a good, a very, very good amount of knowledge on those. So maybe not work much on the working uh, kind of uh, profile, but basically more into design, where you understand how the things are going to work, and assign the task to the specific set of engineers, and design the networks as per the requirements. So that is a kind of a role you you might be getting into based on your current experience as you are moved from your country to UK. So that's something uh, what is generally expected. Now, now if you are looking now, because as per your profile, you basically more uh, suits onto these kind of roles. But again, you have to see whether you are actually applying those kind of roles, or you are applying for any kind of data center uh, engineer kind of role. Because now your profile uh, talks a lot. Okay, so if you are moving onto the data center profile, you need to add. More on the data center kind of profile task, a little bit. Uh, that's something you can do, or you can uh, just uh, modify your profile because your profile says a network consultant. So maybe you can uh, modify that to a data center engineer or uh, senior data center engineer or network senior uh, network engineer or this kind of kind of profile. That's a kind of a role you can change if you are completely looking into it because that basically suits you. Uh, your uh, plan but again if you are not because as per this you have doing the aci course and you want to get into more on data center maybe cci data center the pro so what the profile whenever you see the profile the first look you get is you will be a more suitable for this kind of job roles and if you are not applying for this kind and basically your profile doesn't suit according to that so the first thing you have to decide whether you want to go for this kind of role, the same roles what you have been working on, uh, which is a mix of uh, routing switching or the security along with the data center, and maybe some other uh, file load balancer, these kind of roles, uh, whatever it means, whether if you're going to this or you want to get into a specific uh, kind of role. So that that's where you need to decide and probably you need to expertise on the skill set. So whatever the skill set, the second thing you need to start working on uh, expertizing the skill set. Now, expertizing the skill set means whatever the skill set you already know, you need to uh, you need to update the skills. Like let's say you have a knowledge of FortiGate firewall, and you also add that in your profile. So which means you need to revise this FortiGate uh, firewall so that uh, prepare some interview questions, these kind of things. Or if you are implementing some any other uh, networks like VPN or anything, so you would revise the skill set. So revising the skill set is very important whenever you are moving on to a job because most of the time what we do is we generally uh, keep on updating, but we normally try to forget or we don't really uh, revise the skill set that because because they might ask you some very basic questions sometimes uh, very basic as per your profile. But sometimes if you are not in a position to handle the basic questions, that's where you might also fail. So try to revise the skill set, whatever the skill set you possess, update your skill set and revise as per the new version or whatever is running as per the syllabus or as per the uh, device versions. And then you can add any other skill set 
like you're doing ACA course because you have been already work experience in the data center and all those things because you have been working on the VDCs and all, you know, relating data centers. So probably you can add more uh, skill set, which, uh, which you have been already working on with a skill set like ACS course or any other things. And then add that experience relevant to that. That's something really uh, helps again. Okay. So, and, and what I think is you also need to work on this one. Now you need to decide if you're going on the data center mode, probably what I suggest you to do is I suggest you to update your uh, profile a little bit, a little bit more on the data center experience. Because at then when you join the company or when you show up the experience, they just see the title and those things. Of course, the roles and other things. A uh, little bit you can add more out to the data center kind of roles. That will uh, probably help uh, you in this side. 